everybody, Phil here for AndroidCentral.com, and today is the day, finally, HBO Go on the Nexus 7, which is what I've really been wanting to run it on since we got the Nexus 7. Been a couple false starts uh, earlier today. They updated the app to say it worked for Jelly Bean. Well, it didn't actually work for any Jelly Bean devices. They have since fixed that, so kudos, HBO. I know I gave you a little bit of a hard time. So let's fire up the app. I definitely want to take a look at this. Very, very impressive. Now, you're going to get a little splash screen, and then you get this little welcome screen. So you have three options. Browse now, sign up, or sign in. Now, to actually watch anything, you're going to have to have a cable account here in the States, and you're going to have to already have HBO. Sucks, but that's the way it is. So I'm going to sign in because I actually have a cable account in HBO, and I have Cox. So I'm going to use Cox, and I'm going to sign in, and we'll be right back. Okay, so we're back and we're gonna sign in. And booyah! So it's gonna reload all these tiles again that you already saw in the background and they're actually panning very cool. I think they interact with the tablet as you tilt the tablet, although it could just be playing tricks on me. I'm not quite sure, but it looks really nice. So let's see, and you can actually scroll through them and, and see more as well. Up at the top, we have some options here. You have home, movie, series, comedy, sports, documentaries, and late night. Makes sense. Here's a little mini button. Watch list, search, and settings. Let's just check out the settings while we're here. You have your HBO Go profile. You have parental controls. Very important, so you can create a pin. Keep your kids out of stuff they shouldn't be watching. Series pass, so it delivers every upcoming episode of a new season to your watch list automatically. Set one for all your favorite shows. I will definitely do that. Preferences, 3G video playback. So, ooh, so you can do this over 3G if you have such a connection. Uh, help, let's see, about HBO Go, login account settings, features, technical questions, mobile devices, let's see. So it's pretty much a fact. So uh, a lot of good answers in there. Connected TV devices. Cool. Game consoles, what game consoles? Yeah, so this is just a huge FAQ. All right, so what should we watch? Let's pick something. Um, how about, wow, whole bunch of stuff. All right, let's watch the newsroom because I'm a big fan of it. I like it. I know a lot of people don't, but I don't care. So tap it in the big pool of tiles here and we get a whole bunch of information. Uh, this is the season finale here called The Greater Fool. Gives you the runtime, how long it's available until, and it's only available till uh, the end of September. Interesting. Play preview info. Let's see what info does. All right, so it pretty much just dives into the uh, episode itself. And let's just watch and see what it looks like. Turn up the volume a little bit. And that's not bad. The quality looks okay so far. Oh, we're gonna take our time getting going though. Let's see if we can just pan ahead. There we go, and that doesn't look bad at all. In fact, I'm now going to use this on all of my trips and travels. Thank you, HBO. Thank you for finally getting this done. Love it, especially on the Nexus 7. That's it. See ya. Jerry here from Android Central. If your wife won't let you run around naked, grab a kick-ass t-shirt from shopandroid.com.